First example we got here is just a, uh, a one back power, and this really is no different than what Kentucky was running with uh, with JoJo and the Wildcat against South Carolina so successfully. Except you know we're not uh, going to be faking the jet sweep, and instead of the uh, uh, full back, we've got a uh, tail back lined up even, but the blocking scheme is is the exact same. Now what you want to see first of all is that in the trip set here, uh, since this linebacker uh, walked out with the final slot, watch uh, Pat, he's going to go ahead and give him a motion and bring him over here on this side and have the linebackers uh, bump back over so that he can run the one back power right into that spot. You watch Pat here. He gives him a little signal like, ah, uh, that's not the look we need. Get over here on the other side. Yeah, there you go. Get over here. Now, with the one back power, what uh, I'm going to do here is, is really, in essence, is to uh, cross block with the uh, with the two guards onto the linebackers. The uh, play side linebacker uh, is going to pull here and seal him and he's going to pull, not pull, but it's going to lead up uh, and seal him. And then the uh, quarterback is taking the snap. This is obviously a direct, direct run. There's no fake, no read, no anything. It's just a Waiting for his guard to get through. There's the block on that go that linebacker. There's the block on that linebacker. Here's a seal block by that tackle. Here it's the running lane. Uh, one back power, no different than uh, the Wildcat. Here's another version of the same same play actually, with now the. Uh, Fullbacks in the game, and he's going to uh, lead this way, and the guard is going to uh, go lead out, and we're looking to uh, trap that player there on the end of the line of scrimmage. The quarterback is going to take the snap, uh, fake this handoff coming this way, just to kind of hold him and hold him. There's your fake. Now you got your fullback and your guard pulling uh, to lead out onto this man. Kind of a, a situation where the reason your quarterback is playing quarterback and not running back because uh, his vision told him to go inside in this gap, but the play uh, was being sealed that spot and actually to run this direction but that's the second uh, second way they ran the quarterback power now with uh, they had two backs as opposed to one but still it's not any type of read the touchdown run was simply a, a designed quarterback draw and the uh, middle linebacker just ran himself out of the play the We're going to double team this nose and drive him back. But notice the uh, middle linebacker is going to run right past uh, Pat on the play, clearing it wide open for him. Here's your middle linebacker. And he misses the tackle. Here's the double team on the nose. That's beautiful. And then Pat plays running back. quarterback draw. Here's just another quarterback draw and the, notice the linebackers don't uh, don't feel very well. Play starts, they're both on the line. And then he just runs through. They just let the Hard crashing ends 
Park this way. Uh, double team on a nose, drive him that way. And then uh, read the linebacker. Not much different than an uh, inside zone for a running back. And just notice that the running back's leading through. He missed the block, but what do you expect? The running back. Look at that. What are you doing? Stand your feet. Tried to cut linebacker and wailed and missed, but still a nice six yard gain on first down. This play worked simply because uh, Mississippi State got caught in a uh, uh, misalignment. Notice the uh, there's no uh, overhang player over here either. This safety uh, needed to be down or this linebacker needed to bump out. Uh, but in any case, we've got the uh, we've got a main advantage out on the edge, and that's that's pretty easy. Here's the uh, quarterback draw again, and we're just going to take our uh, uncovered guard uh, and send him out onto the middle linebacker, wash him down, ride him out, ride him out. Hold the ball, back up, read the block, and get to the end zone. Now notice this linebacker, uh, instead of squaring up and running, taking on the block, kind of running from it, uh, ran himself out of the play. This defensive lineman came off the block, but by that point, Patrick already had or he ran through the tackle, touchdown. So just combination of quarterback draws, uh, kind of attacking that middle linebacker. I'm assuming that uh, Brown saw something that he liked, figured we could get a good scheme advantage uh, on their middle linebacker and, and take advantage of it. And that's what they did.